Now you have new super fast 4G, it'll make things like downloads using Facebook and searching on Google unbelievably quick. You'll also be able to do things you couldn't do before, like choosing films from our film store and watching them on the way home, or multiplayer gaming on the go. If you want to look after those megabytes, you can always use Wi-Fi instead. Follow these simple steps and you'll be streaming and downloading in no time, literally. If you already know how to set up Wi-Fi, skip ahead and you can learn about how to use your Galaxy S3 as a Wi-Fi hotspot. Press the menu key, then settings. Put the Wi-Fi switch to on and click Wi-Fi. It's left of the on-off switch. A list of available networks will appear. Choose the one you want to connect to and enter the password if prompted, then tap connect. Your network's now showing as connected and the Wi-Fi signal bar is displaying in the panel at the top of your screen. And that's it, you're all set up. Your Samsung Galaxy S3 can also be used as a Wi-Fi hotspot. This means you can connect your iPad, tablet or laptop to your phone's EE network and enjoy the benefits of 4G on these too. To do this, press the menu key, then settings. Tap more settings and tethering and portable hotspot. Tap portable Wi-Fi hotspot settings to the left of the on off switch. Then configure. Now here's the technical bit. You can change three things. The router name, this will be shown as the name of your network, the security type and your password. The security is already preset to WPA2, but you may need to change this if the device you're trying to connect doesn't support this. You can also change the password to make it easier to remember. Save your changes. Hit the portable Wi-Fi hotspot switch to on and search for this hotspot on your other devices. Select it from the listed networks. Enter your new password. Your device is now connected to your Wi-Fi hotspot. Check this is complete by sliding open the notifications panel. Below the words Wi-Fi hotspot active, it will show that you have one connected user. You're now fully connected to the 4G world where anything is possible. For more help or information about your Samsung Galaxy S3 setup, check out ee.co.uk forward slash Galaxy S3 help.